day and a semi room tour because I've actually moved. As you can tell, my old room never had a bathroom. And no, it's not a green screen. So you guys are probably like wondering where I moved to. I moved to Mars because I realized with the, everything going on in the world, Mars is just a safer place to live. I don't live in Mars. If I lived in Mars, I feel like everything would be red. So I actually moved to Dubai. That's right. I don't know if you can tell from the light and it's actually nice. It's not like gray and moody like England used to be. And this doggy is interrupting my filming. So I moved to Dubai because I mean Dubai is Dubai. Dubai is awesome. Dubai is the best. But we've like we moved in a month ago. So I've only been here like a whole month. I don't know if some of you have noticed. If you watch my gaming, then you would have noticed the background change. That was because I was in an Airbnb and now it's just changed again, which is super duper annoying. But yeah, by the way, this is like ghost concealer. I'm not actually gonna look this pale. I just need it for my blemishes, which I sadly have a lot of. Ah! Currently, I kind of am feeling homesick only because I miss my dog. So my dog is staying with my nan, which we all kind of know if you are like fans from like years back. My nan's a bit of a boomer. She, um, I've sung her, I pranked her, I pranked her, and she really just does not understand any of that. So my dog's staying with my nan, and she is going to be coming over shortly, hopefully. So I think that's why I'm feeling a little bit homesick, because I really miss Lady. I mean, she's my emotional therapist and my best friend at the same time. Do you know, kind of need. I literally don't even know. <laughs> I've just been putting this concealer on without a mirror, and I've only just, like, put the mirror on now. Say hi to you guys. Hi y'all! So I just gave me doing pretty quick makeup because I'm sure you guys don't want to see me putting on like a full face makeup. I feel like I'll just put on some concealer and do some eyebrows. You know, because I kind of have none at the moment. Although it's not as bad as it used to be, right? If you guys are like new-ish and you haven't like watched my old, old videos, I have no eyebrows. I literally look like a baby bird with mounted cheeks. Honestly, I don't understand where my eyebrows were. But they've kind of come back, but that's because it's been like three years of tinting them and colouring them. So, you know, I feel like they've kind of stained. And this concealer right here is so annoying because it doesn't blend very well. But it's the best I've got at the moment. By the way, do you like, do you like my bathroom? I have a, it's a, it's a Versace towel. No, it's just normal towel. My gosh, I look so pale right now. I hate like makeup bags because whenever you need something, it's always like gets pushed to the very bottom. But I finally got it out. I just used this Eco pencil. It's quite new. My Gucci one from a year ago is like almost run out, which sucks because it was actually really good, but it was 95 pounds. And that's expensive for an eyebrow pencil. It's fine. As you can notice, my hair is now brown. My poor hair wants to die right now. I'm not even joking. Like, it's been red and it's, like, dead. And it's, like, really short. I'm so tempted to, like, cut it again. And it's almost, it's almost been a year since I originally cut. And almost two years, actually, since I cut my, like, long blonde hair. I'm going to give you, like, a bathroom tour, though. So, like, this is me with a really big mirror. I have a gold sink. I have my little bits and bobs. I have a get naked bath mat. When I tell you that my shower is humongous, I mean my shower is humongous. Now, it might not look big. It's very lopsided, okay? But, like, it's big. I can do a bath bed. I want to try, but I feel like I might fall on my head again. And that really hurt. Do I even attempt to risk it? Yeah, that one gonna risk it. So I have got a walking wardrobe. My other one was better, but you know, it has got space. Ignore my organization. I can't stick to anything. Like literally one minute, oh my God, I've really done my makeup really bad. But like one minute I'm like, oh, I'm gonna be so organized. And then give it a week. 
and I'm not any, and it's not organized anymore. It's a big fat mess. Let me know if you like that. This is my bed. It's actually a king, so it's super duper big, and it's comfortable. Because I've been here for like a month now, and when we stayed in this Airbnb, my bed. Oh my gosh. I didn't sleep well for 24 whole days. Like I would wake up every two hours. That's how bad the bed was. It was hard. It had a massive dent and I hated life. But now I have the mattress that's like fit for me. I need like a really super duper soft mattress. So now I have it and I don't like getting out of it. But anyway, here's my bed. I mean, Prince, Giao, Albert and Phil and a plant pillow. That's pretty much it. Wait. I'm just gonna show you a couple of things and you tell me what do you think was like a necessity for my room? Was it A, a bed, B, furniture, or C, plants? Let me know, let me show you. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, so maybe I'm like a little bit obsessed with plants, but like plants is my life. And if you guys think like I'm done with plants, when I do a room tour, if you guys want me to, I'm gonna walk in and it's gonna be like, I just walked into the Amazon rainforest. I just got this rug. So this is like the rug that's on my floor. It's quite cute, it's soft. It's different from the one I had in my old room. It's not as fluffy and soft. This is hot here. Let's actually see how hot it is in my room right now. 25 degrees inside. Do you see that? 25 degrees. Celsius inside. That's how hot it is in my room right now. You, usually, I'm sure that's quite hot for you guys, but like I'm kind of adapted now, so it's not as hot. 32, which it was last night. That's hot. So um, this is my wardrobe. I have to do that. I haven't getting hangers today though, so I might do it. I say I'm gonna do it today. I'll probably do it next weekish. No, I'm gonna try my very best to do it today because everything I own is creased. So I've been like living in the same things, which is gross, but comfy at the same time. And then I recently just got these curtains. Now they are blackout curtains because I, I don't know why. Ever since I was like my sister's age, she's like, how old is she? She's seven. Ever since I was like seven, I've needed like pitch black or I can't sleep. When I say they're blackout, let me show you. Oh wait, hold on. It's cause my, I was gonna say, it's not as dark, but it's cause my bathroom lights on. Let me just turn that off quick. Like this is how dark it gets in my room. And it's like 10 in the morning. Yeah, I mean, I actually still wouldn't be able to sleep because of that. <laughs> that looks so creepy, oh my gosh. And the very last thing about my room, but it's actually not a good thing. It's like, you know when people like scrape the fork on the plate and it goes like that, That's how it feels for me. That's pretty much everything in my room right now because we've just moved in, so there's not a lot there. Let me know in the comments, like once my room is done and looking like the Amazon rainforest, let me know in the comments if you actually want to see it. I'll see you next time. Hi.